This week in the Imperial Valley, the New Bethel Baptist Church of Brawley celebrates 100 years. The Imperial Valley Symphony's 47th season plays on, and a local mural becomes a memorial for those lost to COVID. I'm Alexis Soto, and this is your Desert Review Weekly Webcast. The New Bethel Baptist Church of Brawley marked its 100th anniversary June 2nd, having originally opened in 1921. The church was presented with a resolution of congratulations by the Imperial County Board of Supervisors at its regular meeting this Tuesday. Pastor Joe Connor of the New Bethel Baptist Church has been the pastor of the church for over 30 years and said he was proud to accept the resolution. Connor said, it's a gratifying moment for the church and just a testament to the hard work the church has done over the years, serving the community of Brawley. The Imperial Valley Symphony began its 47th season performing the best it could last Saturday after more than a year of inactivity at the Jimmy Cannon Performing Arts Theater. Founding music director of the symphony, Joel Jacklich said, for 15 months, the orchestra was not allowed to meet and rehearse. Boyle Heights resident and celebrated artist Ernesto Llorena Montejano and his team of fellow artists created the untitled 13th foot high, 75 foot long mural, which now graces the south wall of Cynthia's Flower Connection, located at 739 North Imperial Avenue in El Centro. The mural took just over a week, being completed on May 30th with a team of more than five painters. One side of the mural's dedication plaque reads, this mural is dedicated to the lives lost during the COVID-19 pandemic in the Imperial Valley. We hope it serves as a space for people to mourn the loss of loved ones, to honor their lives, and to celebrate the beauty and resilience demonstrated in our community while responding to this difficult moment. This webcast was brought to you by One World Beef Packers in Brawley, where they've supported commerce in the Imperial Valley with more than 650 jobs. For more information on these stories and more, check out our free website at thedesertreview.com. Remember to like and follow us on Facebook and Instagram and pick up our weekly paper at a location near you. I'm Alexis Soto, and this is your Desert Review Weekly Webcast.